Hey everyone, it's Angela and happy Saturday. The last video I made was about using a foot pedal as a push to talk feature in Discord. In that video, I had someone request that I make a video tutorial on how to keybind a mute button in Discord. So today we're gonna dig further into that and we're going to see how to keybind, you know, a, a letter on the keyboard or I can even use the foot pedal to mute myself and rather than going into Discord and right clicking and hitting the mute button. So, all right, let's begin. All right, first thing you wanna do is go to Discord. Once you're in your Discord, you're gonna head over to user settings. Then you're gonna look for keybinds on the left-hand side. Once you're in keybinds, you're gonna see a long list of default keybinds. The list goes on and on, not really. So what you wanna do is you wanna focus on this where it says action. There's nothing assigned because I don't use the keybinds. So what we're going to do is we're going to hit this, then we're going to go to push to mute and we'll do the toggle mute as well. Now what push to mute means is you have to hold it down to mute yourself. Once you release, you're going to be able to speak again. Toggle is you press the button once, let go, whether you got to go get a drink, use the bathroom, go eat something, you come back, you hit that same button, you should be unmuted again. So we're gonna do the push to mute button. I'm, for this tutorial, I'm just gonna sign it, make it easy. We'll use letter M for mute. Once this is done, you can escape. Now we can choose a voice channel. Now remember, we did push to mute. So that means we have to hold it down to mute ourselves. So I ran into an issue earlier and I'm gonna show it to you. So we're gonna go into the temp voice channel. And as you can see, I'm speaking. I don't have push to talk on, it's open voice. So if I hold down M, watch what happens. It's muted because I'm holding it, but look what's happening in the chat. This is what's happening. It thinks I want to speak. So what I figured was we, what you could do is you can just go into the voice channel itself. And then if I hold down M, now I'm muted. No buttons are being pressed. Nothing's in the chat. And now I'm going to release. And now we're back to speaking. Unmuted. Now let's do the second way. The toggle mute. Alright, back to user settings. Back to keybinds. Change this to toggle mute. We can leave M alone. I'm going to go back into a voice channel. We'll go back into temp. Now if I press it once, it still thinks I want to talk, but I'm still muted. Nobody can hear me but you. All right, so we'll do the same thing. We'll go back into the voice channel. You could see that this is white, this is muted. I'm still muted. No hands on the keyboard. Now I'm unmuted. You can see me speaking in Discord. I'll press it again. Now this will work the same way as the foot pedal. You're just gonna use whatever button you want on the foot pedal software and just plug that into Discord on the keybind section. So now that that's done, you can now choose whether you want to hold the button down or you can either just press it once and just leave it alone. Now, like I said, going into the voice channel itself seems to be better than just chatting here and um, pressing the button, right? Because if you press the button while you're in the main menu of Discord, the main screen, right now I'm technically in a text channel. So even if I'm here, but my cursor is here, it still thinks I want to chat, but I'm talking at the same time. So how do we avoid this? Well, we can certainly use the foot pedal that I used in my last video. So let's see how this works. So we're going to go back into the settings. We're going to go back into keybinds. So we'll do push to mute and you saw that work. So I have F10 registered. If you remember my last video, so I'm going to click on keybind, press on this. We're back to F10. Now we can go back into that same voice channel. Now, as you can see, I'm, I'm speaking. So we did push to mute. So now, it's pushed and I'm currently muted as Discord says. And as soon as I release, the microphone is going to disappear or the mute button is going to disappear. There you go. And you can see F10 is not being played in the chat. So there's nothing there. 
this is probably the best option to use or you can use probably one of the F, F keys, the function keys on your keyboard to avoid using a letter because you can't use the function keys in the chat. So you can either use a foot pedal or you can use the F keys if you don't want to spend the money on a foot pedal. Now we'll do the other scenario. Keybinds. We'll do toggle mute. Same scenario. I mean, same uh, button. So F10, toggle mute. Press it once. That's it. Press it again. Boom. We're back in business. So like I said, you're going to use a foot pedal or use the function keys and uh, you won't have to buy one of these. But this is convenient if you don't want to mess around with the keyboard and you just want to use your feet to control uh, what you use for the keybind. So I hope you found this video tutorial helpful and hopefully you'll be able to follow the steps that I've provided. You can try the other ones that are, were on that list that you can assign. And if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe, comment, and you can find me on Twitch, social media, all under the same name, Field and Furious. And I shall see you all in the next video. Take care. Have a good one.